I'm so tired. I just want to lay down. Uh, I can't wait to try these new melatonin pills. Oh, hi, baby. How's your day? How are you doing? Mm, how are you doing? How are you feeling? Feeling okay? Me? I'm, I'm doing okay. I'm doing okay. You know, I'm just relaxing. And, um... And yeah, I'm just relaxing. And, uh... Staying, hanging in there. <laughs> you know how it is sometimes. Work can be exhausting, but I just finished filing these last couple of documents and I am feeling great. Um, I got these new uh, melatonin pills and I can't wait to try them out. They're three milligrams. Um, and they smell weirdly enough of mint. <laughs> Let me. Here you can smell. Here you can smell. Yeah, of mint, which is weird, but hey, where am I to judge? As long as I get to sleep a good night's sleep, these are good in my book. But yeah, no. Um, I can't wait to just moisturize my skin, take some melatonin pills, and knock out. How are you holding up? How are you doing? How are you being? I hope you are holding up okay? Feeling good? Feeling great? Mm. Mm. Yeah. You know, I recently have been struggling with my sleep, that's henceforth the melatonin pills, <laughs> but I have been thinking a lot about life and I've been thinking, how lucky of a person do I have to be? Like, I've been thinking a lot about this. I really am one lucky guy, aren't I? You may ask yourself, why do I say that? I'll tell you why I say that. <laughs> I say that because whenever I think of life, whenever I think of you, I tend to recognize how blessed. I wouldn't want to say luck, because luck is such a, such a gamble. Whether sometimes people get it, some people don't get it. It's a blessing. Which I realize is the same thing as like, because some people don't get blessings, some people get blessings, but... Okay, you get what I'm saying. <laughs> Fate? <laughs> Fateful? Mm. It's a fateful encounter? Mm. That sounds way too businessy. Uh, no. Point is... Grateful, I guess. Genuinely grateful I am that I have met you. Give me your hand, I want to hold it. Sometimes I think to myself, where would I be without this person? Where would I be without the love of my life? Where would I be just... Or how would I be as a person? I can't... Can't even imagine it. <laughs> the pure blessing that I have is you. I can't. I can't believe that I've been blessed with such a beautiful soul in my life. Are you, are, do you, well, okay, do you have a more beautiful soul than my best friend? Okay, watch it. <laughs> watch it. Hey, know your limits. No, I'm joking. Um, my best friend has a special place in my heart, but you have a different place in my heart. Is that a good way of dodging that question? Because that is a bombshell of a question. Mm. 
I often think about what our future would look like together. You know, my best friend and my brothers being great, actually, horrible uncles. Me and you trying to get them to not spoil our child. Me and you lovingly caring for them. Baby, you are. Baby, you are special. I can't wait for our child to have your beautiful eyes and your sweet voice. Hey, if you end up getting pregnant with a with a boy, can I name them Rye? <laughs> yeah, like Catcher in the Rye. Rye. Why Rye? <laughs> I want to name my our child. I name our child after my best friend. He's always been there for us. Remember when you thought I was breaking up with you because I ghosted you? Because <laughs> I hyperfixated on a gift? Listen, my ADHD hyperfixations, those are. <laughs> those are interesting in and of themselves, okay? I'm, I'm, I'm just being honest with you, those are, uh, those hyperfixations, I don't control them, but I hyperfixated on making you that gift, remember? And my best friend had to basically talk you down from borderline dumping me. <laughs> uh, there's a reason he's my best friend. <laughs> he understood. <laughs> I can't believe he understood my hyperfixation better than you. Come on, baby. I thought you knew me better. Kinda of sad now. Aww. Why would you do this to me? I thought I was you. I thought I was your boyfriend. Turns out, I'm nothing but a man. That, wait, no, that that literally is what I am. Never. Okay. <laughs> I am your man, and I will always be your man. You know the. I'm glad that I met you. You being someone so genuine, so caring, so sweet, so loving, someone so real. My precious little princess. My incredible good girl. The best girlfriend I could ever ask for. <sighs> I'm so lucky to have you. Beyond lucky to have you, actually. Yeah. I am lucky to have you. Um, hmm, let's see. Who's a good girlfriend? <laughs> um, okay, who's a good girl who just happened to be my friend who I'm also dating and I'm absolutely in love with? Now, who's my precious little baby? That's you. It's always been you, always will be you. Silly goose. Hmm, I'm so sleepy. Tell me though, you know, I've just been, we've been having this late night conversation about hopes and dreams and the future that I imagine with you. Princess, could you tell me how you've been doing? How are you holding up? How's life been treating you? I haven't heard you talk to me about it in a hot minute, which is really concerning that I think about it. 
I should be worried. Like, alarms are going off in my head. Like, <laughs> who should I contact? <laughs> should I contact the, the, the head office? Or should I contact the police? Who's getting murdered next week? Like, that's just... You know, like, I just feel like there's gonna be a murder. And, like, listen, I'd be great at helping you hide the body. But, like, you gotta give me, like, a warning. You know, like, I gotta prepare the gravesite and all that. <laughs> yes, silly, of course I wanna hear all about your day and your week and whatever else is troubling you. You're my girlfriend. Why wouldn't I? Your voice is a literal gift to me. Of course, I'd listen to it all day, every day, any day. So I don't care what your exes or your friends or um, whoever it is that told you that your voice is annoying. I don't care what they say. I love your voice. And I will hear it from now until the end of time. Because I don't give a fuck what them other motherfuckers say. You mean the world to me. And you are my world right now. So whatever they said is meaningless to me. Okay? Now that we have that out of the way. Tell me. My love. How are you doing? Yeah, I remember last week you told me you've been stressed. Oh, you still are? My poor baby. What else? Yeah. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I know, baby. It's hard, yeah. I know, and especially. I know. I know. It's okay, yeah, it's okay. I'm here. Yes, princess, I know. It's frustrating, yeah. It, yeah. I know. I know, trust me, I know. Hey, but listen, listen, listen to me, listen to my voice. You made it through. And I'm proud of you. You worked hard. You got out of that, and I'm beyond proud of you. Okay? I know it's difficult. I know it's not easy. I know it cannot be easy. No, please know that you're doing an amazing job. And I am beyond proud of you for everything that you've done. And for everything that you're doing. You're doing amazing. Hey, come here. Cuddle up in my arms. Yeah, you're getting baby princess treatment tonight. Uh, uh I don't want to. I'm not hearing any of it. No, <laughs> come here. You've been through enough. Let me spoil you, my precious little princess. Let me spoil you for all that you are. 
Yes, this is happening. No, you cannot stop it. No, no, <laughs> no means no. Okay. Now either you're gonna accept the baby princess treatment, or I will give you baby princess treatment regardless. That you have no choice. With all honesty. How do you expect me not to baby you, care for you, love for you, pamper you, and do all of that for you? After everything that you've been through. God, I love you. Stay. Could you stay in my arms where I can hold you, protect you, and love for you? Until my days expire, I love you so much. What are you sleepy? I haven't even taken my melatonin pills. You haven't taken my melatonin pills yet. <laughs> I'll, all right, I'll skip them for tonight. I'm not sleeping until you fall asleep to make sure that you're safe from the outside world and from the inside world too. I'll stay here until you fall asleep. Sweet dreams, my precious girlfriend, my sweet and loving girlfriend. My absolute gem of a girl, my good girl, my princess. <laughs>